A housing charity in Herefordshire says hundreds of young people may end up with nowhere to go if the council goes ahead with proposed cuts to its budget. The Supported Housing for Young People project is facing a 66% funding cut, but the council says it's being squeezed by central government. Callum Watkinson spoke to those using the service. I didn't feel like a member of society. I didn't feel like a person. Hugo Suggs' low point came at the age of 18. Homeless, he ended up sleeping in the foyer of this bank in Hereford. I was kind of on the streets, homeless, and didn't have any kind of massive support network around me, and I lost my house. And I, I, yeah, it was, it was scary. But Hugo found his way to the Supported Housing for Young People project, or SHIP. I over my, my life, really. They, they really did save my life. When I was at my lowest, so when I wanted to jump off the bridge, the River Wye, um, I knew SHIP was there. The charity helps young people who are homeless or at risk of becoming so with housing, life skills and employment prospects. Herefordshire Council has proposed a cut of two-thirds to their budget though, which they say would also slash the hopes of many vulnerable young people in this county. We work at SHIP to really um, put a belief in our young people, a belief that young people can achieve, a belief that young people can go on to have successful lives. And ultimately, the loss of this service will be the loss of young people having that hope for the future in Herefordshire. In the next financial year, the council will lose a third of its government funding, £9 million. It says central funding will continue to fall from £26 million a year now to less than £1 million by 2020. They will have to save an extra £28 million by then and an extra £87 million over 10 years. The council isn't picking on SHIP or indeed any other provider uh, that provides us services. The council has to look at all our providers to make sure we are getting value for money uh, for the taxpayers' uh, pound. The council is facing huge financial challenges and therefore it is even more important that we look very carefully at how we spend our money. The council has to fund adult social care, a cost that's ever rising as the population ages. For the young like Hugo, now at university, it's not clear how long Herefordshire Council can keep this ship afloat. Callum Watkinson, ITV News, Hereford.